I'm so ready to do some thrifting. I'm just gonna go to the local Goodwill and just see if they have anything. I just love thrifting. I love that I get a bargain. I love that I can reuse and upcycle and give these things a home. Join me for a day of thrifting. It rained like crazy yesterday and now it's just beautiful. I'm looking kind of rough. And that's okay. It's just kind of humid outside, so I don't know if there's any point to doing my hair today. Plus, I'm just gonna go and thrift some stuff. Yeah, I just want to like take a look around and see if I like anything. I feel kind of eh today. I actually worked a half day yesterday, and then like I went to the store. And I was like, oh my gosh, I haven't been to the store in like forever. I usually get everything delivered. But I was like, you know what? I think I have enough energy to do that. And lordy, it was like a workout. <laughs> but it was fun at the same time. You know, you're getting there when um, it's fun going to the grocery store. <laughs> Drinking some tea. And I'll show you that I made like a lemon loaf. I made it with the blender and I put a whole lemon in it. I didn't even cut the lemon up. I just put a whole lemon in there. It's tasty. It's lemony. I don't know if people would like it if they didn't like lemon stuff. Because it is, mm, it's not bad. But I feel like it needs a little, mm, I don't know, not so much citrus flavor at the end. But I don't know. It's still good. Here she is. And I put a little sugar glaze on it. She's happening. I'm actually really tired. <laughs> So I think I'm going to nap today, take it easy, and I'll wake up early and I'll thrift tomorrow because uh, today for some reason it just feels really hard to leave the house. I don't know if any of y'all can like relate to that, I mean, I'm sure you can. I'm just like, I just I need to take my injection pen today, my Humira, and I'm I'm kind of like, mm, I don't know, injection days are hard sometimes, especially when you don't feel 100%. Oh, well. Tomorrow will be a better day um, for thrifting. We'll see you tomorrow. literally the most perfect day outside it's blue skies and like 65 70 degrees and i am so ready to do some thrifting i'm just gonna go to the local goodwill and just see if they have anything i'm very much a granny core cottage core cozy core aesthetic girl just gonna be looking for things that suit my fancy join me for a day of thrifting That car, like, gave me butterflies. I just like thought for a second, I was like, oh my gosh, what if it was like a hundred like years ago and those cars were all the cars and I was just romanticizing my life for a little bit. Oh, it was perfect. It was perfect for this video because thrifting and like looking at older things like makes me reminisce and nostalgia just gives me all the serotonin. So, yay. Wish that I could stay Wish for this moment to never go away But it's all in my mind And 
Though I know that there is nothing to find You're a beautiful sight in the summer night And you can't put up a fight in the mist We got some things So I think that went really well Um, I got a lot more sweaters than I thought I was gonna get Will. I'm gonna go to one more shop. I'm gonna go to Savers to see what they got. I didn't get like any cute little like trinkets or cute little things that just make the house feel a little bit more homey. I'm just like, I'm really craving an olive tree in my house. <laughs> I really want one. And I saw some at HEB and I'm like, oh, I'm really tempted. Maybe me and Joe will go today and get some, get some plants at Home Depot or something. You're a beautiful sight in the summer night And you can't put up a fight in the misty light Okay, so I got a few little trinkets from Savers. I think I got a pretty good thrift haul. Super happy with what I got. I just love thrifting. I love that I get a bargain. I love that I can reuse and upcycle and give these things a home. Anyway, I am hungry so I'm gonna go back home, um, have some food, and then I'll show you everything I got. I think it's always good to sage things that had previous homes um, just to cleanse the energy that they're holding on to and they don't bring anything bad into your house. I got this white sage from the farmer's market. That's smoky. <laughs> Instead of doing like, you know, get my light out and everything, I would just do a very impromptu haul of everything that I got. Yeah, and then I'm gonna wash everything in like hot water. <laughs> Joe's taking a shower if you can hear him. So I spent a total of, I spent 47.01 at Goodwill, and then I spent 12.96 at Savers. So I spent like, like 60 bucks on a bunch of really good stuff. Let's get to the haul. First, I'm gonna show you this beautiful piece of kitchenware. I love it. You probably see it a lot in the thrift stores, but I really love the art on this. It's this beautiful little pot. It's solid. I feel like I could put it in the oven and make like stews in it and pasta. And I just love it. It was $9.49. I just love the design. I love the colors. I have a color palette that I go for, like creams and, and ditzy prints, browns and neutrals. I really love this. I think this will be beautiful to add to the kitchen. I can't wait to make something with this. It's gonna be amazing. Let's just stick with kitchenware. I got this at Savers for $3.99. It's like a set of little soup bowls. Um, they're ceramic and they have this pretty little crisscross design. They're just really simple and nice. Um, I thought like I could make like maybe like little chicken pot pies in them. I don't know. For Joe or veggie pot pie for me. I thought they would be really great, you know, for soups and stuff. Bargain, $3.99. Next, I had to get some candlesticks and tapers. I got these at Savers. This one is just beautiful. It's this gold plated taper it's for $3.99. I just thought it would be really nice to have. Like maybe like in the book area, I could light it and like just read by candlelight. I think that's so romantic and very aesthetic. I. I just love that. I just want to be surrounded by books and candles and tea and cats. Yes, that is my dream life. And this one is just really simple. Simple glass taper. Something I think I could keep on the kitchen table and have dinner. Dinner by candlelight. How romantic. So I got this sheet <laughs> and it has this pretty ditzy floral edging. I thought it would make a really nice tablecloth maybe. It's a small 
thin size. I need to wash this in hot, hot ass water. Get everything off of it. Um, Cause you never know. <laughs> I've been really looking for just a, a nice ditzy tablecloth, and I see people use like little ditzy like sheets all the time. I'm very happy to put this on my table, make it nice and pretty. So I got a book. This book was like $1.99. I love Leanne Morty. Um, she's the author of Big Little Lies and Truly Madly Guilty and The Husband's Secret. The Husband's Secret is so good. Moriarty? I, sorry, I'm, I'm butchering that last name. She's a great author. This is her book, What Alice Forgot, in paperback. I love paperbacks, by the way. It's, I love how they feel. Yeah, I can't wait to read this. Uh, it was $1.99. I couldn't pass it up. I definitely recommend looking for books at your local Goodwills or thrift shops. You can find some good stuff in there. I got a basket. <laughs> oh, it's just so nice. It has these handles. Baskets are so, they range from like, you know, so much to so much. I saw it and I really liked it and it was only $5.49 for this baby. You can make anything like prettier with a basket I think. It's springtime. I want to go on like a little picnic with this little basket and put like some picnic things in here and just take it and just be cute. I don't know. Read under a big tree in Zilker Park. Just really, really craving some springtime stuff. The only thing I don't like about spring is the bugs but I just have to <laughs> wear a little wristband and spray all the eco-friendly bug spray on me. <laughs> $5.49 for this. So nice. I love the color. I love the handles. <laughs> the last two bits are going to be clothing items. I couldn't resist getting some cream sweaters. <laughs> I couldn't resist. So this is the first one I saw. It was kind of like in a mix between like a sweatshirt and a... I, don't, I think it's like just a really aesthetic sweatshirt. <laughs> Basically, it's v-neck has this ribbed collar, it's really nice, and it has the ribbed cuff sleeves. It's just really soft and cozy, and it's by Ari, Ari, and it was only $6.99. Really happy with that. Wear this to feel cozy around the house, or I can wear some jeans with it and take it outside, wear leggings with it. Maybe it's long enough to wear as a dress, who knows? $6.99, I'm taking it. Next, I got this like nude, beigey, brownie, this taupey color sweater. It has these, and this knit pattern, so pretty. And it's really long and super soft. I don't know, I saw it, it's my style, $6.99. Could not pass it up. It's like Sonoma. I think that was like a Target brand a long time ago. <laughs> yeah, super cozy. I can't, I can't, I see sweaters and I can't pass them up. I can't. I know I got a lot, but I'm a fall cozy girl and I get cold really easily. So I just wear sweaters like all the time. <laughs> Last thing is this sweater here. It's like a big swoopy turtleneck collar. And it's just so nice. Kind of thick too it would be perfect for autumn it's american eagle this one was $8.99 can't go wrong with cream sweater i'm like a little what's it called there's that like it's kind of not great it's the that vanilla girl aesthetic going on where they just wear cream jumpers all the time and i'm like that's been going around like forever before you ever put a title on it but I want to like Latina it up, like it's not vanilla, it's um, if you're Latina it should be, it's that coconut rice drink, horchata. <laughs> <laughs> I wear just a bunch of like creams and beige, I'm just like horchata girl, That that's what I would like to be, horchata girl aesthetic. No, I'm more grandma core, lover of all things cozy and sweet just introvert core really I like what i like yes i folded this terribly let's do this again yeah all right i'm gonna wash everything now that was my thrifting haul i think i did a pretty good job i only spent like 60 dollars and i got 
three sweaters, a pot, two candlesticks, a tablecloth, and a basket, and a book. It's good. That's good thrifting. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching this video. Give this video a like and subscribe to my channel if you're liking the videos. Thank you so much for being here with me. If you made it this far, leave in the comments down below a little coconut emoji. Yeah. <laughs> for our chat that girl aesthetics. Yes. <laughs> I'm cringing myself out here. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I need to get on editing this video. And I'll see you guys next week. Love you. Bye. Oh.